Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. A few weeks ago I have tried to train with Wandao and today I will try to make my own by myself. So for this weapon I'm going to use normal stick, what was a stick for window curtains and this old saw which is going to be my blade. First what I have to do, draw the shape of my Guandao blade and start cutting. So I have already drawn my blade on the saw. So this is going to be part from my handle and this of course is my blade. So you can see it's going to look quite nice. Okay, so I have cut already my blade. How you can see I cannot make this perfectly clean. But later I will try to work with this so this blade is going to be nice and smooth and it's going to shine a little bit. But how you can see this looks actually really good. But right now I'm really happy about this blade because it makes nice sound. So I go found some iron for the handle. So I found some old bike and I think I'm going to use this old uh, wheel for making nice handle for my Wandao. So I have found some pipe and I will connect this wheel from the bike over here. So after that, when I put together my blade and pipe is going to be like this. So now we have to connect these two pieces. Okay, so my handle looks like this right now. I have this this wheel from the from the bike. And the pipe is connected to this. It's not straight because when I when I have to know the with hammer, so this wheel is not straight anymore. But it doesn't matter. Right now, I want to have to find some way to connect it with my blade to this handle. So. It's going to look like this. My idea is that I'm going to connect this blade somehow inside. I think I have to put something like some wood inside and put this together and screw it so this cannot move. And maybe a little bit connected from outside again. But from another side, when is the stick coming? I'm going to. My idea is that I'm going to put some screws so I can I can release it. So it's much easier with transport, so because this is around, I don't know, 10 centimeters plus this, so together probably is around half meter, and the stick is like one and a half meter, so it's two meters, so it's not easy to transport, but when you release it, this part, just put together with stick, is much easier and better. So for the beginning I have to make some mark here so I know how deep have to be the blade into the stick because later when I put the handle I'm going to cut this part so this part is not connected to the stick so I can also remove it this blade from the stick let's do the mark here this is mark here I can also make some marks like where I wanna put screws for for the blade so we are almost ready so now you have to go and cut it. Of course I have to make one line here so I can put the blade inside between the wood and after this I'm going to screw it so it's going to sit tight inside. Okay, so right now I have already space for blade in the stick. You can just see now how it's going to be everything together. So now I have to just connect it wood to the blade with two screws. After this, I'm going to cut it a bit lower. So this part is going to be connected to the handle, and I can have a like small, small sword. <laughs> But rest of the handle you can release it from the stick. Okay, so now it's time to connect my blade to my handle. So now I will just use the hammer and knock this down. So 
right now and there is almost ready look at this and the wood is inside so I am sure that I cannot lose the blade now the screws is inside it's almost ready to connect it with stick so you can see the final result so right now I'm going down all like this actually taller than me I think it looks pretty cool and on the end I think I wanna put some rope around this iron so this looks more more nice I think what you're going to see in the next part of the video, I think it's ready and now make the part when I'm testing this weapon outside with some cuttings and different stuff so let's go to another part of the video